Alright YouTube, what is up everybody? It's me, Video Games and More, and I'm back with another appliance review. This is not my stove, this is my friend's stove. Um, I helped them pick it out. It's um, the same model that I have, except this is the electric model, and this one's in black stainless compared to my gas stainless unit. But this is the Frigidaire Air Fry Range electric version, minus the gas version. Um, and this one's in black stainless steel. It's model GC... RE 3060 AD. Um, you can see it's very, very nice, although I do prefer gas. This is actually a pretty cool electric stove. Um, um, I helped them pick it out. I would have gotten them gas, but unfortunately they don't have a gas hookup here. Their house is all electric. But you can see here, um, it's got five burners on the stove top. This one here is a triple burner right here. So this one can allow you to do three sizes of um, cookware here and then this one's a dual zone and you got some smaller ones in the back this is a warming zone great for keeping things warm um go ahead and i'm going to turn this big burner on to show you how awesome it is and you can see gets hot immediately nice big burner right there oops all right and then the control panel, it is currently air frying some french fries. Um, you got bake broil, air fry, convection bake, convection roast, quick preheat. You got your oven light setting, your door lock. Um, you see, controls identical to my gas one. Um, and then, see here the inside, I'll go ahead and open it up. I'm sorry, got steamy. There are french fries in there right now. I do apologize about that. But you can see it's absolutely beautiful. Um, it's got a lot of rack positions. I'd say this one's a little bit bigger than the gas version because the gas one has some burners that take up the space. Um, and then my friend's gonna turn on the light for me. Go ahead and push it. Oh, be careful, okay? There we go. See the light? Let you see inside. Um, it's very quiet, about as loud as my gas one. Um, I'd say this is even a little quieter than my gas one because my gas one's got burners that run, but still my gas one is very quiet. Um, now, this one did arrive slightly damaged. There is a dent back in here, down at the bottom. And then this storage drawer doesn't shut all the way, but the salesman was very nice. They gave us a $75 discount. 50. Yep, 50, that's right. He said 50 or 75. Um, and then they, so basically you got a free air fry tray. Mm -hmm. Yep, because the air fry tray normally cost 50 extra dollars, um, where literally he just got it for free. Isn't that nice? Yep. So this is the electric version of the air fry range. It does come in a front control unit model. So does the gas one. And it also comes in induction models too. But it... We have paperwork right here. You see the instruction manual and everything. It's got a anti-tip bracket, which you can install. And this is something mine has too, the probe. And it plugs right in there. You see, right in that little plug right there. That's where that probe plugs in. Well, there you have it. That is the, um, Frigidaire air fry range, the electric version. Um, I'd say it's great for people who like electric stoves. Um, I prefer gas and I prefer the gas version, which is what I have at my house. But the electric version is great for people who want an electric unit instead of a gas unit, because I know some people are a little afraid of cooking with an open flame. On um, my opinion, I love it and I'm very glad I have a gas version, but the electric one is great for people who either don't have gas or don't like gas. Well, there you have it. That is the Frigidaire model GR, GCRG 3060 AD, um, the freestanding electric air fry range. Thanks for watching.